stop. If you're watching this before 1 p.m. Pacific time on December 22nd, make sure that you drop what you're doing, transfer and catch as many Pokemon as you possibly can. Why? Because that's when the double candy event is ending and then double Stardust is starting. So good luck on all of your Stardust if you're watching this or all of your candy if you're catching and transferring. But we have a couple things to do today. I have my research breakthrough box. And remember, for the month of December, you could get a legendary bird, a shiny legendary bird, or a legendary beast. I haven't checked it yet, so let's find out what I've got. Also in this video, we're gonna be using my Meltan box. Because it is the last full day of double candy, I wanna get as many double candy Meltans as I possibly can, and then we're gonna transfer them and see how many Meltan candy I can get in this one session. Start encounter. Oh, it's a Raikou. This is actually my second Raikou. So far, I've got two Raikou, the Spin Second, and a Zapdos. Pretty amazing, I'm pretty happy. Let me know in the comments section below, what have you guys gotten out of your research breakthrough box for December? Nice. So, we caught the Raikou because today, like I said, is the last day of Double Candy. Make sure, well, if you're watching this right now, if it's before 1 p.m., that you transfer as many things as you can, catch as many things as you can. Wow, this is a good one. So, and luckily, now I have 15 Raikou candy. Nice. Okay, so now let's total up how many Meltan candies I've previously caught. Looks like I've got 69 Meltan candies currently. Well, you know that the mystery box, once you open it, it's just like an incense. It only lasts for 30 minutes, and so I'm gonna put on the mystery box, I'm gonna open an incense, I'm gonna lure up this area for 30 minutes. Let's see if I can get shiny Deli Bird, shiny Santa Hat Pikachu, shiny anything, and maybe we can pick up some cool new Sinnoh Gen 4 Pokemon Munchlax, Chingling, and even Mantike are in seven kilometer eggs now. You can see that the sun is starting to go down. So let's get to cracking. Let's get on the Meltan box. Let's start it. Let's do this. Mystery box. Activate it, you open it. The way that you get the mystery box is by transferring Pokemon from Pokemon Go into Let's Go. Okay, the mystery box is on, the lucky egg is on, and the star piece is on. You actually cannot um, you cannot use an incense at the same time as the mystery box. So, take note of that. Here's my first Meltan. Now, let's see how many candies I get. If I Pineap him, I'm going to Pineap it, and we're going to also Ultra Ball. You know, Meltan is a mythical Pokemon. It's not easy to catch. It's never going to be easy to catch. So, always just do Pineap Ultra Ball, so that way you can just get onto the next Meltan or capturing to the next Pokemon. Let's see how many candies I get. Awesome. Let's find out. Double candy is active. All right, we got 12 Meltan candy. That's awesome. We're now already at 81 Meltan candy. This is incredible, just after one Meltan. So let's take a look at my inventory, starting at Raikou, and now we have Meltan. Let's see how many cool Pokemon I can capture in 30 minutes. Let's go do it. Walk sign is on to cross Fremont. That's pizza. Walk sign is on to cross. Pineapps, but honestly, I can't think of a more worthy Pokemon to use silver pineapple berries on. 
So let's check out Meltan. Oh my God, I have 267 Meltan candy now. And that's without transferring these Meltan. But I'm not gonna transfer them right now. I'm actually gonna go home and try to convince my roommates to trade all their Meltans with me. Try to get lucky Meltan, because yes, Meltan is a mythical Pokemon that you can trade. So it's fantastic. I hope that you guys have a lucky Meltan, because you know, if it's a lucky Pokemon, it has really good stats usually, with a minimum floor of probably, what, 12, 12, 12? Yeah, so try to get lucky Meltans, everyone. It's amazing. I had 69 before. I effectively got about 200 candies in 30 minutes. That's amazing. And let's take a look at all of my stuff. I got Deli Bird, Santa Hat, Pikachus, Snovers, so many cool things. I saw a Magikarp raid over here. Let's finally evolve something for the Pokedex and see if I can get a shiny Magikarp. Let's go try it. Well, everyone, let's do the Magikarp raid. Why not, right? You know, you might even be shiny. <laughs> Let's use all of my Santa Hat Pikachus and my brand new Santa Hat Pichu, which I just hatched earlier uh, yesterday. Look how cute it is! Oh my god! I can't wait to test it out in battle. So everybody, remember, December 22nd at 1 p.m. Pacific time until December 26th, you're going to get double Stardust when you capture Pokemon. So get out there, still capture everything, and make sure that you have a star piece on if you're playing Pokemon Go at all. Because, you know what, with all these third moves for PvP, the second charge move, you need as much Stardust as possible, right? So, use your Stardust in PvP. I recommend uh, using, well, Mewtwo. Just use stuff that you want to use in raids, too. Like, if, you, if you're a type of person that uses Mewtwo in raids, or Tyranitar in a raid, or your dragon types like Rayquaza in a raid. Actually, I wouldn't recommend Rayquaza because he's not very good in PvP. But use stuff that you're gonna use in raids and PvP. Maximize those Pokemon first. So if you are if you love to battle with a certain type of Pokemon and you love to use it in raids, that's the Pokemon that I'm gonna prioritize getting my third move for because I'm gonna use it the most, right? Makes sense to me. Let me know in the comment section below. Which Pokemon are you prioritizing to put the candy and Stardust in for your third charge move? Well, second charge move, third move. Let's see, if it's shiny, it's not shiny. But you know what else I noticed while I was walking over here? That my eggs have hatched and somehow I missed the hatching animation. So I have no idea what I just hatched, but my seven kilometer eggs did just hatch. So let's open up my eggs and see if I got a Munchlax, Mantike, hopefully maybe a shiny Elekid, shiny Pichu with a Santa hat. I don't know. Let's open it up. Let's find out. And I just got 12 candies for that March carp. Is that a good one? Simply amazes. It defense. Excellent. Eh. I'll probably candy that one. Actually, let's do it right now. Because double candy. <laughs> okay. So let's take a look at what my eggs hatched. We'll go to recent. Uh, looks like I hatched a Pichu, which I actually used in battle. Nice. I, used, I hatched a Smoochum, Diglett, Alolan, Tyrogue, Meowth, Kalafa, adorable, and uh, a second Pichu with a hat, and another Tyrogue. Sweet! I actually love these Pikachus with a hat. They're so cute. And of course, 263, that actually might be pretty good. It amazes, defense, blown away. Sweet! So this is the same one that I just used in battle. Guys, let me know in the comment section below, what are you hatching? What are you going to use your candy and stardust to get that other move? What are you doing for holidays? Where are you going for Christmas? Are you just going to be at home like me? Or are you going to go out to see your family, your parents, your other friends somewhere else in another state? Let me know what you're doing. I'm excited to be hanging out with you guys. You can be expecting live streams. Oh yeah, and I need to plug this Sunday, 1 to 4 p.m., you can expect another Let's Go Pikachu shiny hunt competition. This weekend we're hunting Venonat. If you want to participate with all of us, go ahead. Why not? No one's going to stop you. Please do, actually. Um, you know, Join in, 1 to 4 p.m. Pacific time. Be sure you know when that is for your time zone. And also, on the 22nd, which is tomorrow, or today, depending on when you're watching this, tune into the iHeart Gaming live stream. You guys can find him, check it out. I'm gonna plug his Twitter right here. Go check him out, guys. He's doing a charity live stream on the 22nd. Check him out, it's gonna be all day. He needs your help. Go give him some love. And other than that, guys, I hope you're having a great holiday. Smash the like button, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next one. See you guys then.